Oh, guys, so sorry for that interruption and commentary. Venny are clutching out the stock in the first 15 seconds of the game with the up B win box, and then numbers somehow pineappling on a battlefield slope like that. That was definitely really, really unexpected. Um, I don't even think numbers was even tilted at that at all. You were just like like noting how interesting the situation was. But right now, you see Venya like really, really making sure that Numbers stays uncomfortable at the edge of the stage where Numbers usually likes to retreat. That's where he likes to play, that's where he likes to dance around. But Venya is like pumping up the aggression, making sure that he's not gonna get away with those ledge goals for three, just as he was mentioning. Um and right now. Uh, Nanya, ooh, great nails into an up smash. That was so, so good. And a back air. And right now, John Numbers says, be really, really careful. <gasps> ooh. And that was definitely Numbers stock to take as well. And I'm really surprised that that wasn't even the sweet spot on the spike. The down smash, not enough to kill. Got the other hitbox of it. Um, but Numbers coming back to stage aggressively, resetting neutral effectively, and right now Venya simply landing a raw forwarder, calling out the fact that Numbers is being too aggressive with those dash ins. Numbers should be playing back just a little bit more. And right now, Numbers needs to find a way to pile on just a little bit of damage, but, um,. You know, Venia is at, sitting at a very, very convincing lead, and he just, you know, he just needs to. Oh? Mm, going, trying to read the low recovery, and Numbers almost not making that back. His up B releasing just at the very last possible second, but we fits Magnet Hands coming into play, and so right now there's a great neutral just like further stacking up the damage, and I feel like right now Numbers' whole rhythm is off. After that little little unfortunate mishap in the first uh, in the first stock, and that's okay. He'll live and learn. You know he'll come back from it. Um, yeah, forward out, very strong three out from Venia. Um, right now, just numbers. Just like a big old deep breath. Just like reassert. You know, like what's happening because you just saw him going with these empty dashes and getting punished for it. You saw him like throwing out like up bears out of shield. Um, that were really, really, really misspaced, but, um, so, just like Numbers, um, definitely has the knowledge and, and the know-how how to do this. He just has to, uh, compose himself just a little bit. Three, two, one, go! Anyhow, going into game two right off the bat, we already got the deep breathing coming from Weefen, the barely immediately, but not being able to convert off of it because obviously a barely at zero percent means you can't really particularly mash anything. Numbers going through the commitment to a down air and getting away with it essentially. It covers an option, it could have taken out a stock. It's definitely low risk and high reward. Um, but right now, Venia, ooh, Venia missing that, and Numbers just able to like slowly and gently drift down uh, to to get a little bit of further breathing, and you just see John Numbers like like playing that like don't touch me game so so well. Like Venia is like trying to get it, he's trying to come in with these dash attacks and these down tilts, but Numbers is just not letting him. Numbers is playing around and circulating the ledge so well. It was a great back here from Numbers just to keep Venia off. And Venya leading the diagonal air dodge down, but not unfortunately able to connect it. Um, right now, like number, like this is a completely different game. This is like a, two, a completely different player from game one. That was so good because if he didn't land, who? Okay, yeah, because if he didn't land the spike hitbox, you know, that would have been the back air, and if he did land the spike hitbox, that would have been the stock. I mean, right now, Numbers is, like, able to rack up so much damage with those suns. Ah, oh, got to drag down up air, but expecting Numbers to miss the catch, but Numbers so on point, and yet he still succumbed 
to the up smash. And right now, this is very, very, very doable for Venia. 65-81 is what I would say. The, suddenly, the percent in equity is ever-growing. The distance between numbers and Venia is, is rising, and Numbers is playing back a little bit on uh, Venia trying to lead the tech in, but Numbers trying to retreat to Legend. So right now Venia has that noted, and he's going to try to go for the tech out lead next time. And so right now, um, you know, Venia is able to string along those uppers, bringing back the game. Numbers is going to find a tough time landing, but able to do so by just gently and slowly drifting down. And the down tilt into up smash, enough to kill John, recoiling in real life. Uh, a little bit confused about what just happened. Not able to connect the down tilt into a dash attack. And you just see, like, Numbers. Again, like Numbers is maybe going in a little prematurely, and that air dodge off is dangerous, but Numbers is able to come back unscathed, though I don't believe that was the re grab quite yet. Um, right now, Numbers did a fantastic job of coming back onto stage. Right now, this is a ledge trap opportunity. Numbers playing around the ledge, this is where he's most comfortable. Uh, great reverse hitbox on the F tilt, and the up air not quite enough to take out the stock, and the F tilt still not enough to take it out. And again, a great back here. And this could be really, really big. Ah, uh, but Venia just a, maybe... Maybe he was just not at the perfect percent to get the nail into a forward air. And so right now... Um, ooh, that was so good! That was so good! That was a great down to the test smash. Ah, uh, and Venia trying to get the win box again from Numbers, but Numbers able to drift just above it, making sure that he wasn't going to get pushed into any blast zone or the potential incoming F smash. Great dash attack. I love the aggression from Numbers, but Venia still able to smack Numbers back off stage. And right now, this is going to be very, very tricky. <gasps> what? I've. Okay, I've seen people fall out of up smash. I have not seen that happened, but regardless, Venya getting a very, very clean down tilt into Florida. A great show can just to intercept John through off his momentum, through off his timing just a little bit. And right now, John is re-grabbing Ledge, but that was a great recovery mix-up. But Venya was ready. He was ready with the down tilt. He was ready with the down tilt into Florida. Very, very clean 2-0 from Venya. I don't want to count the first game. I feel like John definitely held much more of his own. John had the momentum in the first part of the second game, for sure. But then Venia was just like able to consistently close off those stocks. Really, ah, it was it was it was, it was lovely. And I'm, I've been chef kissing all night. I've been I've been giving lots of compliments. I always like to support players, especially when you just see phenomenal talent as uh, Venia. You know.